Mantan Molin, Stephen Fetch it, had a disease. Don't you catch it? Will he best the test? Confess when you hear his name. Are you ashamed? Amos and Andy were just like candy, eaten by the white folk. Just another black joke. Even now, Joseph was boasting the white race would see the jazz singer if he was in blackface. We always saw the black man cow, saying, Feet don't fail me now. Being scared of every ghost. Why should the brother be scared the most? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Faces in the painting smile when he's all alone, scared by the noise he always hears the moan. Even Charlie Chan, a Chinaman is braver. Number one son ends up the lifesaver, but the brother just stands there shaking, paralyzed, screaming for help, rolling his eyes. Mr. Chan, Mr. Chan, come and rescue me. Is this the kind of thing you want your kids to see? Nothing happened when the man's around. Everything's fine. There's never a sound. All the demons and ghosts are exercised. The scared old black man's just telling lies. Scared of the dark again. He's chicken, talking just like a hen. He's chicken, but as soon as the white man goes away, the coffin opens and the zombies start to play. Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? I grew up thinking the things I'd see of African Americans on TV or in movie shows was reality. Who created all this imagery? It wasn't a black man, that's for sure. All the insults and jokes that we endure comes from a place called Hollywood Hood, where the poison is made and put in our food. Another kind of gangster runs that place and makes decisions about our race. Producers, directors, heads up the studios, write the words we say in all the shows. That's why the brother's always looking scared. A big buffoon when he's compared to the hero of the story. Always braver in his blue-eyed glory. A lifesaver. Thank God for white folks. What would we do if we were forced to depend on you? How can the brother be any good when we have to fight the Hollywood hood? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Don't fail me now. Who that say who that? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Mr. Chan, Mr. Chan! Beats don't fail me now! Who that say who that? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree? Why should the brother be always the one to see the candle move or the monster behind the tree?